Hey, how's it going everyone? This is the Anime Man. Welcome to Yonderella. Oh yeah, we're finally doing this, baby. So, the last RPG making game that I did was Mogeko Castle, and you guys really wanted to see me play this game next. Um, so, and I was really interested in this game actually when I first heard about it. Um, I haven't seen any gameplay footage for it, all I've done is heard about it. So, uh, it's gonna be really interesting to see what this game is like. So, yeah. I guess it's got to do with Yandere's. Who knows? Let's give it a go, shall we? This game contains violent and grotesque depictions. In other words, it's gonna be really good. <laughs> this story is a work of fiction. Any resemblance to anything is a coincidence. Even that cat with the yarn ball, because that looks a lot like me. Oh, hey. Presented by Sharon. That kind of looks like, um, that kind of looks like that, fuck, what's her name from, Higurashi? Whatever. Once upon a time, there was a beautiful, kind girl named Cinderella. And though she was more beautiful, more kind, more precious, more cheerful than anyone else, it never did her any good. Her sisters worked her to the bone every day. Oh, this is just Cinderella, alright. She was unable to go to the ball, unable to meet her prince. All she could do was clean, a princess covered in cinders. Wait, is that why she's called Cinderella? <laughs> oh wow, you are very pretty. Hinata. Yataro? I was finally able to see you. I've been wanting to see you this whole time. <laughs> it's been a while, huh? I'm your bride. SCORE! Yeah, I thought it was just like, yes! <laughs> I am the princess fated to be your bride. I hope you cast a spell on me. Oh god. Already? Oh, that's... Okay, first of all, that's me in the corner just looking pissed the fuck off even though this girl's just like, I love you, I'm your bride. And he's just like, ugh. Uh, fuck, what do I do? I guess we cast it? that first day like I said I have no idea what this game's about it just had Yandere in the title and that immediately caught my attention so no come on Yataro Get up, sleepyhead! Oh, it's like, is it like your typical. Oh, hello! Honoka. Ah. Oh. I gotta do a different voice for her. Jeez, you're finally up! Good morning. She's got a little bit more deeper voice. You were making a racket there? Were you having a scary dream? Well, I'm sure you just have something. Wait. Well, I'm just sure you are just having some kind of dirty dream. I know you. You perverted fuck. <laughs> Why are you in my room, intruder? <laughs> huh? Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me you forgot already. I emailed you about it the other day. Hinata's arriving today, so we were going to go to the station to meet her. Hinata? No way. Are you saying you forgot about her too? I'm shocked. You really are horrible. Hinata, the one who moved to Tokyo when we were little. The three of us would play together all the time. Don't tell me you really don't remember her. I remember it all. Meep! <laughs> Let's do meep! Haha, <laughs> there's no way you could have forgotten. We were all so close back then. The fuck does meep mean? Whatever. Jeez, get a grip, will you? Come on, it's almost time for us to meet her. Hurry up and get ready. Uh, I'm ready, I guess. The station is just to the east after leaving your house. This is... Very interesting already. It's like a visual novel made in the RPG. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, here I am, looking like a girl for some reason. 
And I got Honoka with me. Skills. Stubborn Hikikomori soil self at this age. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, what does Honoka have? Hella mad. Looks menacing when mad. Super strength. Stronger than you expect. Cooking skills. Can cook well. Okay. Equipment? Oh wow, this is like a full RPG, huh? Bunny. I offer my save point services throughout the nation. Care to save? Yeah, let's do it. Wow, this is... Okay. A bunch of my favorite manga line up on the bookshelf. There are some dirty magazines too. Oh fucking course. You are a dude after all. Inside the drawer are a bunch of games in a messy heap. I can't decide whether I want to sell them or keep them. Fucking keep them, man. I always keep mine. What do you... Let's look at our search history. Damn it. Probably got some fucked up shit in there, huh? Alright, let's get out. Oh wow, okay, this is a much bigger house. Inside the drawer are passbooks, seals, and other important things. Okay. Mom's favorite dinner plates are lined up. Some of my favorite pudding and gelatins. The phone? The phone we got for 1980 yen. It's tiny. That is around 20 bucks for those who are interested. What's the teddy? One of my most precious stuff. Oh, okay, this is your mom's room. Anything in the bin? Magical girl Misato san -tan's super secret notebook. Read it. Do it. Magical, magical girl Misato san will use her meowgical, meow, meowgic to save the world. This is my super important mission. I'm not messing around. What? What? Don't look at me that way. Perhaps you're not convinced. Oh, the puns are real. Jeez, alright, I'll let the cat out of the bag. Ugh. I'll show you my true form just this once. Look, I'm just a perfiline normal high school guy. Chock full of moi moi charm. Oh my god, you gotta have that moi moi charm. It's not like I've been used to being a magical girl or anything, okay? I'm sure mum would like to forget about that part of her. <laughs> Great. So, is that why we always look pissed off? Because we have a mother who uh, we don't we do not talk about in this house. Alright, let's get the fuck out. Well, this is a rather tiny town. Jesus Christ. The art style is very interesting. Park. There's a fountain here. Yeah, which is like the same size as my fucking head. The table of chairs have been polished with shine. I wonder how much they pay people to clean them. Not a lot, I presume. I don't need to go into the hotel. Okay. Where the fuck's the station? Is this it? Oh, yeah, here it is. Hey, they used a real-life picture in the background. There. This is gonna be fun. How many years has it been? Ah, oh, jeez. What a great time to have to go to the restroom. Hold on, okay? I'll be right back. Why do you have a bandage in your hair? I'm guessing that's a ribbon. That's... That's the Dumine. Bad background in the building. I've been there a few times. In Tokyo. Oh, hey, Hinata. Why you look so sad? Ah! Yataro? Is that you, Yataro? It is! It's Yataro! Yay! It's me, Hinata. Do you remember me? I transferred away during elementary school. I used to play with you and Honoka all the time. <laughs> Did I surprise you? I return, finally, back to this town. It sure is nostalgic. Oh god. <laughs> Yataro? I was finally able to see you. I've been wanting to see you this whole time. I think she wants the tea. <laughs> it's been a while, huh? I am your br- Oh, okay, this is the beginning. I am the princess fated to be your bride. So it wasn't just a perverted dream. I hope you cast a spell on me. Let's not cast a spell this time. Let's see what happens. Uh, okay. Hey, Yataro. Do you want to know why I came back here? I'll tell you, just this once. Just keep it a secret, okay? I came here to meet my prince. Hey! Cock blocked. Just what do you think you're doing, jerk? Get away from Hinata, you perv. Hey, man. What the fuck? Plunk. Honoka's fist hits my cheek. Ouch. Hey now, Yataro, are you okay? Honoka, violence is a no-no. 
Yeah, I thought all you dumbass. Don't get cocky just because you haven't seen Hinata in a while. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> just say sorry, gentlemen. I know, I know it may seem not correct, but just say sorry to get that shit over with. Good, at least you're honest. It's been a while, Hinata. I've been wanting to see you again. Yes, it has. I've wanted to see you too. Both you and Yataro. Especially Yataro. I'm glad you two look so energetic. You're looking pretty cheery yourself. That's a relief. Once you found out you were moving, you wouldn't stop crying. And now I bet you have plenty of fun in Tokyo even without us around. Well, I can't say that I don't, but I really do like it better here. This town is so much better than Tokyo. But the building in the back is in Tokyo. Huh. <laughs> Three of us are standing here and talking again is like a dream come true. But it's not a dream, right, Yataro? Damn fucking straight. <laughs> Pinch your cheek to find out. Hmm, I guess that would be the easiest way to find out. Of course, it's gonna be your cheek, Yataro. Ah! Hey, Honoka, Yataro! Um, I kinda wanna hang out together somewhere outside, just like the old days. Okay, let's go somewhere. Where should we go? Hmm. Let me think about this, guys. This is a tough choice. Secret base. I know, I know. You won't believe my choice, but it had to be done, I'm sorry. The secret base? Is it still around? Oh. Yataro, you haven't seen it. There's nothing there anymore. Eh? None of it is left at this point, as you'd expect. Is that so? It was quite a while ago, it got torn down. I I still want to go see. After all, we are made so made, we made bleh. After all, we all made so many memories there. Even if there's no trace of it left, that's okay. I cannot read today. Well, I guess that's where we're headed then. If you not Oh, I guess that's where we're headed then. If you're not the wants to go, we'll go. Thank you. The secret base is straight west after leaving the station. Let's do it. This is a really interesting RPG maker game. Straight west after leaving the state. Oh! Like here. Yeah, there we go. This is a really interesting game. Like, it's like visual novel using the RPG maker engine. Oh! A secret base. Sorry, but there was no way around it. The landlord got angry and had it demolished. No! What's this gravestone? I made it for the base, you know. Onoka. I guess I didn't want to forget about it. I actually haven't been here in a while, though. Huh? I definitely didn't put these flowers here. I wonder who did. Don't tell me, you? Yataro? <laughs> well, how about that? You still remembered it after all. I thought you had stopped thinking about it altogether. After all, once Hinata moved, you stopped coming over to play. You stopped talking to me too, and you went and dyed your hair blonde. You even started rebelling against your mom. You just went full on bad boy, huh? Is that so? Not that all. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. Jesus Christ, that second option. Uh, I guess if we go... Fuck, man. I wasn't expecting this to be this kind of game. Uh... I guess if we do Hinata I Love You, it's going to go to her route. So let's just go not at all for the time being. <laughs> Thank you, Yataro.
This place sure brings back a lot of memories. This, this spot gives you a view of the best scenery in the whole town. The sky. <laughs> we, sure played a, we sure played a lot together. Yup. We took all sorts of we took all sorts of stuff from our homes to make the base. Of course, that also got us yelled at a lot. That summer break was kind of special to me, anyway. It was fun. It's not just you. I feel the same way. I'm sure Yataro does too. I'm just like, nah, fuck that shit. Right, Yataro? I guess yes. Didn't give me the choice, so... Oh, look at us, we were all tiny. And I had greyish hair. Maybe that's why I dyed my hair blonde, so that people wouldn't find out about my, like, terribly aging scalp. The sun was beating down on us. After school, the three of us would walk home together. We would always wander around a bit before going home. The strong-willed Honoka and the meek Hinata. Together, we built our secret base and had fun. Every day we would play until the sun went down. When I went back home, Mum would have dinner ready and waiting for me. That's how the days went by. Our, unforgo uh, our unforgettable summer days. But Hinata changed schools and our happy days came to an end. Even when I played with Honoka, it felt like something was missing. Eventually, I stopped walking home with Honoka. I didn't play with her very much. I spoke with, it, with her less than less as well. I hold myself up in my room. Honoka and I became more and more distant. I realized only too late that the only thing that had kept us together was Hinata. Hinata had left for Tokyo. Oh, there I am. Blonde as hell. But now, being shoulder to shoulder with the two of them again, again gives me a strange feeling. We've all gotten a bit older, but it's almost as if we were able to return to those summer days. That's what it feels like. That was fun! I'm so happy that the three of us can be together like this again. <laughs> Don't get too worked up now. But yeah, it sure was fun back then. Uh, not to say that I'm not having fun now. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Neither you nor, nor Yataro. <coughs> Excuse me. Way to break the mood. By the way, Hinata, do you have a place to stay tonight? If you don't mind, and if you're okay with my house. No, that's okay. I'm staying in the hotel. Oh, okay. That's good. That's a load off my mind, too. Let's get together again tomorrow. Okay. It is a summer vacation, after all. Not like I have anything else to do. Yay! See you tomorrow. See ya. <laughs> Bye. All right, guys, we're gonna end this episode right here. But this is a really interesting game. I wasn't expecting this kind of game at all. I thought it was just gonna be like running away from a bunch of yandetters, but uh, yeah. This game is really interesting. I'm really interested to see what is how it's gonna be like or how it's gonna progress. So uh, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this first episode, and we're gonna start this wonderful. Mostly very romantic adventure. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. As always, like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe for me, man. I'll see you in the next video, whatever I make. Keep watching anime. Ciao!